a bad daddy car out here in Australia yeah. today. Drift squid. 1,000 horsepower, RB28, sequential, sick fabrication. Beauty, beauty. You gotta come in backwards, right? <laughs> Back it in. Introduce yourself to the camera. Hey guys, Jake Jones here, all the way from Australia, also known as Drift Squid. I've been watching you on the internet for a long time. <laughs> I've been watching you. You man. got some shred in you. <laughs> My favorite video is in your S13, and you're backing it in, and just rub those tires, like just, just, oh, yeah, 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 just, ru just slightly yeah. rub those tires. That's an OG video. As it gives it away, uh, to the spectator, you can't oh. Oh. It looks like you've leveled up quite a bit. <laughs> From an S13 to an E92 M3, but it doesn't sound like an M3. Nah, I got rid of the uh, the V8. Put something really cool in. Let's look at it. Right. Oh, E92 with, with this. this one. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. 100%. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> this is gorgeous. So tell us all about it. RB26 block, genuine N1 block from Nissan. Then I put a full Tomei stroker kit in it, 2.8 uh -huh. kit. So yeah, got the full counterweight crankshaft with the Tomei rods, pistons. Then put a dry sump kit on it. Mix the bottom end with a full solid head from power tune. So it's like shimless bucket, no floating parts whatsoever. Everything's uh, mounted. Yeah, that allows me to rev it to 10,000 RPM. <laughs> so, uh, wait, 10, what? <laughs> what? 10,000 Johnnies? Yeah, 10,000. In a 2.8? Yeah. I want to hear it up that high. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God. I'm meant to be drifting right uh, now. Yeah, I hear it. Hey, <laughs> hey, shout out to Jake. He heard <laughs> yeah, we were here yeah, doing yeah, build yeah, breakdowns, yeah. so he left. He actually didn't even go to practice, which is right now, <laughs> so he could come and shred for us. You're the real MVP. <laughs> Everybody say thank you, Jake. Yeah, you're the real <laughs> I mean, this intake manifold is beautiful. Yeah, so it's a hypertune billet intake manifold. Seeing a lot of hypertune out here is pretty yeah, much, yeah, is it an Australian company? Yeah, or? they're literally down the road. Oh, okay, yeah. dang. Oh, really? Fabrication on this is beautiful, so I'm just like, yeah. Point out your favorite part right now. Right now is the whole intake manifold side and just all the piping. More donuts? Well, more donuts, you can tell, and beautiful, beautiful wells, not shitty. Is that a computer or did <laughs> a human I mean, do that? No, that's human. That's all done. That would definitely actually. be a human, but. And I, you guys haven't Jeez. even noticed the twin rattles yet. Oh! oh, oh shit. Oh, 12 injectors? Yeah. Sequential injection to basically atomize the fuel a bit different to give it a better intake sound and a tiny little bit more response. Sequential. So that means both rails are spraying at the same time? Uh, or you can either do it that way or individually. Yeah, so it's so like it's that. like boom 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 just to give you an idea. Yeah, that's I don't know, I don't have anything this fancy. So <laughs> that's what it looks like in yeah. finger terms. Yeah, I think I have three rails on my rotaries, <laughs> but there's only six injectors. So <laughs> the forty four gallon drum and the boot to feed it, yeah. Jesus. <laughs> oh man. How big right? is that turbo? What size? Uh that's a ninety one seventy four, a bull warner with the twin turbo smart wastegates. Where where are you hiding those wastegates at? Oh, I see yeah, them. I see them. They're a bit hidden. Oh, yeah, yeah, there they go. There we go. What kind of boost? What kind of power? <laughs> About 14 pounds uh, with this setup makes roughly 500 kilowatts at the wheels. So. Which translates to what? Six, seven, eight hundred, eight hundred horsepower that probably? Be, that'd be six. On the 600? high 600 yeah. side. Six, okay. Yeah. But so, in high boost, 31 pound, it makes six. 100 to six, no, 650 real kilowatts. AKA a ton of power. Yeah, I've never, <laughs> honestly, never had to use it yet. Right, oh, so you pretty much compete on low boost and everything yeah, like that. Yeah, man, like grip, power levels, have not needed it yet. So what made you go from the S13 to the E92? Okay, I'm so glad you asked. Drifting, to me, it's all about style, personality. Right. So you can express yourself, right? Correct. I wanted something that sounded amazing. And then once you heard it, you got, I wanted something to look amazing. In my eyes, it's got the sound and the look. So. I think it's beautiful, personally. Thanks. What kind of suspension? Oh, MCA suspension from up in Queensland here, Australia. And then the WiseFab lock kit, that's just a simple bolt-in kit. Right. And then the coolest thing about this car is it's all controlled on MoTeC, so. That's big daddy stuff right there. That's, yeah. yeah, that's It's dollars. so amazing. Like, there's like probably 40 sensors over this whole car. So, you know, oh, I've wow. got. Oh, wow, so you got data logging for everything. Yeah, so I've got like boost pressure on this side and the other side of the engine cooler. So if there's a difference between the cooler. It regulates and. Oh no, it'll it'll come up on the computer and uh. be like, well, there's a leak here or uh. there's something not right. You're getting like the cooler's not working efficiently enough. Yep. We got temp sensors in the rail for the 
fuel and the fuel tank. We got coolant pressures in the front and the boot because the radiator's in the boot. We've got EGTs on all the cylinders. So basically every little detail about this car that so, will let you know, oh, I feel like I'm a little down on power here or it's a hiccup here, or blah, blah, blah. Yeah. You'll find it. Pretty much. And it's like, it's saved me so many times. Yeah. You know, how many times have you overheated your engine and kept going? Uh, like, <laughs> oh, <laughs> Hey, leave me out of this, all right? This is about you, all right? This is your video. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is amazing, man. The build quality on this is just Thanks. through the roof. Oh, you gotta check the screen out. Motec down. Oh, okay. all right. Okay, so when you turn it on, boom, drift squid. Oh, boy. That's fancy. Wow. Yeah, I love it. Sensors on sensors. Yeah. <laughs> all the goodies. This is a real race car. Is this your, is this like how much boost do you want? This knob here? Yeah, so that's different tuning settings. I've got like wet and dry setups. And, ah, yeah. very cool. At the click of a knob. Before you go out back, let's just take a. <laughs> Let's just take a gander at this cage and stuff. Oh yeah, I've that. got the full NASCAR. Get in there, Rob. Check it out. Here. Oh, I am just Here. nerding out. <laughs> TIG welded. Beautiful coming right through the door pillar. Everything looks sick on this cage for sure. Sick oh, firewall in the back. Those pedals are dope. It needs a good vacuum. Radiators in the back. Dry sump on the side. Fuel Sprayers. system on the other. And a big giant winter's diff down the bottom. Those How are about? sprayers for the Rad 2, right? How yeah, only if I need them. How big is that fuel cell? It looks pretty... No, the fuel cell is factory. Oh, 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 okay. All yeah, right. yeah. I, I thought you said yeah, it was on the other no side. Dog. You're close Oh, no, the, the surge tank. Side. Oh, okay, okay. Oh. You got a skid plate on it, so it's good. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's warping the actual yeah. housing, though. Ooh, so. we're playing games. Yeah. Is this an electric water pump? Yep, correct. So that's just to help get the water back to the engine. Right. Yep. It's a gnarly little vehicle you have Proper here. Proper race car. And the man. ducting back here, just to keep all the air falling into place. Yeah, it's my little fish tank. No scoop, just let it fall in. Yeah, I don't like that scoopy stuff. <laughs> Even like people, they got those flaps here. Right. If you look from the side, it's it, not the same color. You don't want to kill the body line, yeah. especially on an E92 or something yeah. like this fancy. So, And your wheels? Yeah, those? just Advan wheels. Uh, these are just the drift wheels. I usually run equips. Yo, your rotors are huge. Yeah. Oh. And the, they're, they're a long way, but that's stock. That's stock oh, rotors? Yeah. And I just put twin M3 calipers on it. Yeah. Why would you drive an S chassis <laughs> when you could drive a, when you no, could drive? I'm so sorry, better. Rob. I'm sorry for myself. I, mean, I drive I, an FC. <laughs> I kind of hate on my car too. <laughs> That's why I got the S15. <laughs> the track. Oh, oh, I don't got, I don't oh got. I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling everyone. <laughs> so what? You got a sequential in there, right? No, I did. Yeah, I did have, but I've okay. gone to G Force. All right, so just you get the done. job done, man. Just yeah. consistent, reliable. Yep. You can smash, smash gears. Yeah. Cool. Well, damn, man. This car's sick. Yeah. I'm, I'm still starstruck. You know? <laughs> hey, man, much love. We, we appreciate your attitude. Your yeah, your I'm driving sure. style Thanks. is is not anything to sleep on. Yeah. The world the world yeah. needs to be like Jake. 100%. So but it's yeah. time to shred some tires. Are you going to shred some more? I think I probably should, or should I go back to practice? I don't you know. Should, <laughs> I think, I'll do I one quick one. Should. Yeah, just do a quickie. I'll let you hear the 10,000 RPM. All right, all right, all right. All right. That's what I want to hear. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Woo-hoo-hoo. Fucking drift squad! <laughs>